Hey guys, Ben here and welcome back to another video on The Flash Season 6. Today we're going to be talking about the new synopsis for the return of Godspeed and some other stuff. So if you do go on to enjoy the video, please be sure to leave a like and a comment and subscribe if you're new so you don't miss any DCTV videos later this year. So yeah, let's talk about this. So the synopsis for Pay the Piper as it's titled. Episode 18 of season 6 is seeing the return of Godspeed and Pied Piper. This is the May 5th episode of The Flash. So not very long. This is 10 days time roughly. And this is going to be really, really exciting. This is after Liberation, which is the next episode mainly to do with Iris. We're going to be talking about that episode later in this video because there's some more promotional stuff we have to go over. First off, let's talk about Godspeed and this episode. So this is how the synopsis goes for episode 18. Godspeed and Pied Piper return. When Godspeed returns, Barry turns to Hartley Rathaway for help. However, things get tense quickly after Barry realizes one of the changes from Crisis is that the Flash and Pied Piper are now enemies. Meanwhile, Iris tries to escape the Mirrorverse. Okay, so this is really interesting. First off, I need to mention Pied Piper. You remember he appeared in, I think it was like episode 13, or it could have been 12. It was one of the episodes just after Crisis, and there was some change. And in that episode, I'm pretty damn sure he wasn't friends with Barry or The Flash. They had some sort of confrontation, and I'm pretty sure by now, he already knows. I'm talking about Barry. Barry already knows that Pied Piper is not on his side, so I don't know why that would be a surprise. So that's just a thing that I wanted to bring out quickly. But anyway, so let's talk about Godspeed because that is the thing I want to talk about and that's the thing I'm sure most of you guys want to hear about. So yeah, Godspeed returns and it says in the synopsis, when Godspeed returns, Barry turns for help from Hartley Rathaway. So I don't know why he needs Hartley's help. Maybe his gauntlets can stop Godspeed or something like that. But it's probably just because, you know, Barry is losing his speed currently and maybe he loses all of it by the time of Godspeed. But perhaps this may be the episode or the episode before or potentially, you know, just the finale could be one of the episodes where Barry creates the new speed force and he gets his powers back. So I'm guessing probably by the end of this episode, he is able to fight Godspeed. Maybe Cisco and Caitlin have figured out how to create this artificial speed force they've been trying to do for quite a few episodes. But anyway, so Godspeed is back. We don't know why he's back. But there's also an interview that Grant did that we need to talk about in a minute. And, you know, there's a bit more context. But anyway, so Godspeed returns. And, you know, there is no real reason as to why he's returned as of right now. But if I were to suggest why he's returning, it's probably to do with Black Hole. I would say because in the comics Black Hole is linked to Godspeed, they are around at the exact same time, so I don't see why they can't adapt it so that, you know, maybe Black Hole has been working on these Godspeed clones that we saw in episode 1 this season, because we never got an answer to these clones, and since Black Hole started to get teased, and since it's become like a decently big thing, it's not that big still yet, but you know, they're still operating in the background and everything like that. There has been questions as to what happened with Godspeed at the start of the season and what happened to him last summer because apparently they stopped like four or five clones of him during the summer whilst we were on break and then we saw one of these clones at the start of the season and we never got the answer since. So my best guess is probably it's something to do with that or on the other hand it could be Godspeed Returns from the Future, it's a different version of Godspeed, it's not the Godspeed we saw last season, it's not the clone we saw this season because those Godspeeds are locked away right now so it's a new version of Godspeed I would say and it could be just like a one episode thing or it could be something that they're planning to bring Godspeed back, this is his first appearance since those clones showed up and maybe this is a setup for something greater in season 7 but I would probably say it's just going to be like a one episode thing because I don't know, they don't seem committed to actually keeping Godspeed around. They seem committed to having him just pop up every now and again, but that's about it. That's just what I have inferred from all the times we've seen Godspeed. So what do you think about this? Let me know in the comments down below. Do you think Godspeed is going to stick around or not? Anyway, so things get tense. I talked about this between Barry and Pied Piper. This is obviously another cause of crisis. We sort of explored this already, that's why I mentioned it at the start of the video. It really kind of doesn't make sense because we've already seen him and we've seen the dynamic they've got now. Anyway, so meanwhile Iris tries to escape the Mirrorverse. 
so she's still in the mirrorverse by this point i would say that eva's probably out by next episode so that being episode 17 the one before this episode i would say iris is probably stranded in the mirrorverse by herself maybe with camilla or whoever else is still in there anyway so let's move on to the interview where grant says it's an episode where we're going to see some changes because of Crisis, and Hartley Raffaway, aka Pi Piper, is going to be back. In that episode, Godspeed is back. Hartley really isn't a friend when he comes back, but Barry's going to need to find a way to reconnect with Hartley and try to fix what Crisis changed and stop Godspeed and try to save the city. So essentially, what Grant teases is this is mainly a cause of Crisis. Maybe the reason Godspeed's back is because of Crisis. I mean, that could be another option. But anyway, so he's back, and Barry really does need the help, it seems like, of Hartley, so he needs to find a way to reconnect with him to stop Godspeed and try to save the city, because it does seem like this is probably in line with him losing his speed, so he can't stop Godspeed, and he needs someone who is quite powerful. Okay, so let's move on to the next thing. This is the synopsis and photos for the episode titled Liberation. This is episode 17 coming this week, so the synopsis goes like this. Huge changes ahead for Barry and Iris. After recent events, Barry takes a closer look at his life with Iris, and Eva makes a bold move. Okay, so let's break this down. So, there's going to be huge changes ahead for Barry and Iris. Obviously, last episode, Barry literally got booted out of his apartment. So, I think the changes is that Barry is seeing that this isn't Iris. This is a fake version of her, and this is going to affect their relationship because, you know, he's been living with this fake Iris for so long. Like, since I think it was episode 10, Iris went into the mirror, so it's been a long time, and the huge changes for Barry and Iris will be the dynamic when Iris actually eventually gets back, which definitely seems like it's going to be the episode after this, but with Eva making this bold move, I think she does escape this episode, and Iris is stranded in the mirrorverse until the next episode, so Barry will take a closer look. He's sort of a bit suspicious right now, but he's going to become especially suspicious next episode. And I think this fake Iris is definitely going to be exposed. So let's move on to the photos for this same episode. So remember, this is episode 17. This is coming this week. The first photo we've got is of Nash Wells. He's there with Iris. This is fake Iris again because normal Iris is still stuck in the Mirrorverse. So they're in Star Labs. They're by the computer. Seems like they're just helping out with whatever troubles is going on right there. Then we move on to the next photo, we've got Nash again, and he's there with Barry and Cecile. They're using some sort of device. I don't know what it's for, but maybe it's some sort of device to detect if this is an iris or not. Then we got a couple of photos where we see Barry talking to Cecile. Seems like Barry is distracted and he's perhaps focusing upon iris. Probably they're talking about iris because a lot of this episode Barry is very worried and he's very suspicious. Then we move on to this photo of iris. Iris is in the cortex. I think she's just looking at Barry and maybe Cecile, but it's probably more so just Barry. And then we go to the mirrorverse. And we see normal Iris with Eva. Iris is trying to do something. She's got something in her hand. And Eva is telling her to stop doing this. I'm guessing this is a sort of way to escape. But Eva is stopping her from doing this. And Eva's bold move is probably to escape by herself. And leave Iris in the mirrorverse. Then we move on to the next photo. we got Barry with Cecile again. I think they're in a different location, this looks like the kitchen or something, but they're there, they're listening to someone, it's probably Iris talking, and we go on to the final photo, we've got normal Iris talking to Eva in the mirrorverse, and that's about it. So there were actually more photos, but they were all pretty similar, kind of in the same scene, so I didn't think I had to go over all of them. But anyway guys, thank you guys so much for watching, what did you think of this video? Are you excited for the return of Godspeed and for these new episodes? Let me know in the comments down below, but anyway guys, I will catch you guys later, goodbye. I see red.